But Paul, mm. is the eclipse forecast, I know it's just a day later, is it looking any better today? It's such an, it's such an incredible opportunity to get this to come right over Texas, this complete solar eclipse. Unfortunately, the weather does not look good for Houston or the entire state as we head into Monday for viewing the solar eclipse. That's the map for 1 p.m. Monday afternoon on the 8th. Although the eclipse is going to be happening, 95% totality in Houston, complete totality, Del Rio, Austin, and Dallas. Man, we're looking at rain for Houston on that day. Thick clouds viewing will not be good if this forecast verifies for Houston. And then that looks like pretty thick clouds all the way across central Texas, across the path of totality. Right now, it's a 40% chance for rain, probably light rain, but that would mean clouds are pretty thick. So the path of totality in Texas comes across near Del Rio, goes through Waco, Dallas, Fort Worth, Tyler, up to Texarkana, and across the USA. However, as I overlay the clouds and the rain forecast on the path of totality, you can see the rain and clouds forecast San Antonio, Austin, so Johnson City, Central Texas viewing not looking good. Maybe they get a few breaks in the clouds. I hope they do. Dallas, Fort Worth, same story. Cloudy skies are likely to Tyler to Texarkana. Keeps going cloudy. Hot spring to Little Rock, Arkansas, Jonesboro, Arkansas, cloudy. Maybe a few breaks in the clouds. As we get up a little toward the upper Midwest, there's Evansville, Indiana, Bloomington, Indianapolis, Indiana, maybe some breaks in the clouds, but also you can see rain nearby. So it's not set that they'll have clear skies across the middle part of the upper Midwest. We go through Cleveland, Ohio, rain, that's no good. Erie, Pennsylvania, nope. Rochester, nope. Watertown to Burlington, maybe a few breaks in the clouds. I think Maine, if you're gonna get on a plane and you have to see this thing, it looks like Maine is the place to go in the path of totality. Let's go to Jackman, Maine. That'll be the spot, I think, at least according to the latest forecast runs. We have several more days. Maybe we'll get some changes. What a 